scared of the night Always wanting the fright of your life Oh baby, can't you see the monster screamed in your dreams? While you're scared of sleep at night Oh, to tell you that we're in peril of your life You may be just your feet, but I'm not the way I'm not Back in the beach knob, Sally's mansion. Wow. Look at that fireplace. All the radiator. No eyes. It's like main entrance. That's why it's called a uh, Sully's Mansion. Wow. Wallpaper. Sally's house. Old typewriter. Some nice red curtains there. That's a uh, water going around. Another nice fireplace. Look at the features. Just like tall it's in there last time. Look at the red tile. Look there, sort of bed, chair. They're using like hospitals. Definitely seen better days. So this is valued at like 1.5 million. And basically got passed on to another owner. And they just left it in all this disrepair. Didn't even bother cleaning it up or seeing to it. Glass here as well. It's like some sort of pattern. Almost looks like a kitchen in here.
Oh, somebody's car. So, yeah, this is like the cellar basement area. This uh, mansion. Get out. <laughs> That's amazing. It's a book. Seems like it's a uh, great on there. What kind of book is that? Can I make it out? Methodist? Got some clamp there. Yeah. It is like it's some sort of Bible. Very old. It's literally stuck to the table. Accessory. Gonna head up. Again, leave. All these signs saying leave, get out. To make it seem really more horrifying than it already is. And the only horrifying bit is the disrepair in this place. Steps coming up here. So, to this side. Oh, pigeons. Some of the old curtains still on that window. We've got some of the old uh, red curtains here. Wow. It's all of it there. Seems that room's uh, totally at it. It's collapsed. The roof through. Seems like there's been a bit of a fire as well. One of the handrails. Very green in here. And it's saying leave. This is a really nice fireplace.
nails, aren't they? For the nail gun. An old uh, wardrobe. Can overlook the back end here as well. Nice uh, pattern to it. You've seen this uh, pattern on the wall, those tiles, which look really nice. Amazing. We've got uh, an orange fireplace over here. Tiling on that almost looks like brickwork going around, and then down here as well. Look at all the detail, amazing. Again, the tiling. Got some sort of branch in there with flowers coming up. Amazing. And we've still got this uh, bath that's full. It looks like a pond. <laughs> Pretty cool the way it's all tiled around. Amazing. I'm to watch my steps here. Be careful, but look at these banisters. Pretty awesome. And the ladders are still there, which we'll check in a second. So yeah, I'm on the top floor now guys, so I need to be extra careful. And always be extra careful when there's a lot of rubble around as well. You don't know if you're gonna be standing on a weak point. But yeah, let's try to get to that fireplace there, as such. But right, yeah, there we go. Just have to move these out of the way so we get a better look. Look at that blue tiling around it. Amazing. Wow. Roof's proper collapsing on this. Little bathroom here. Sure, what this room would have been. Yeah, it's like an attic. It could have been a bedroom, it could have just been storage. So, yeah, as we were coming in here, uh, obviously, we bumped into someone who was also checking out this place. Okay. Bit wary about these ladders being wooden, quite unsteady. So what I'm gonna do is from this point, is, and it's a good job that I got my uh, adjustable tripod because we can show you without actually. Going all the way up ourselves. Oh, yeah, guys.
again that's what's brilliant about this uh, tripod this it's always safety first oh it's brilliant so we're just back outside now guys uh, there's quite a few other outer buildings to check out but well, obviously we're going to check inside the mansion but on the other side first of all but as we're passing we might as well have a little look in here I suppose this looks like it would have been a workshop going off all the bits of tools and bits and bats everywhere bit of a fire there wow very old cooker there it's weird it's fan hair The fridge here. Ah, oh, that's a very old fireplace. Ah. And the wooden panelling in this place. Open, open bar there on the kitchen. Check this piano. Wow. Oh, what? oh, check that. Yo, guys, check this. Very much in disrepair, but still can play a tune. Things go flying. In laundry room. See the uh, washer there. Sink. Some like really fancy uh, pot hangers back here. What we got? Doesn't appear to be much as a file cabinet. Oh, yeah. Some files, birth and marriage death certificates. Some sort of storage. Oh, wow, so here's the uh, stairway that we would have seen from upstairs. Just watch me step as I go down here because it looks a little Steady. Wow. Wow, what's that? Oh, it looks like an old camera. Looks like an old camera, that. So, yeah, when I was down here, last I saw these sort of frames here. 
And it looks like they must have been doing some, uh, doing up the uh, pictures. Maybe a spare time hobby. As you can see there, you can see a load of picture frames. Dashed about. Some pictures. Pigeons are in a mouth somewhere. Making weird noises. <laughs> Wow, look at that frame. Yeah, it seems like they must have done up some of the old light picture frames. It's like a workshop. Down here, basically all just for that. or woodwork in general. I mean, look at this. Wonder what that would have been off. Look at the detail in it there. It's amazing the like craftsmanship of these things. Especially in that day and age as well. It's a lot easier nowadays to have machines do all that. But to take the time to like, chisel away these bits will take quite some time to do. I wonder what that machine would have been for. Almost looks like a press or something. Or it's to keep the frames in place while well, they're being glued together, maybe. So, yeah, we're coming through into this other room. There's loads of borders and stuff in here. Look at them all. Wow. Boiler, some metal sheets. Huh? But yeah, look at all the borders, all the different wooden borders about to make picture frames like this. Into this room, guys. Wow. We know you, Tom. It's a bit random. The curtain rail going across here with a beam around the room. And then we've got this in the center as well, guys. Wow, look at that. Look at the fireplace over here. We've got this old uh, lampshade. Somebody's boot. But yeah, look at this curtain though, guys. This gold curtain with all these trees on. Wow. It's absolutely stunning. What do we have here? Pull back the curtain. Oh, it's like a table, isn't it? It's adjustable. Or... Yeah, it moves. Let's see. What would have that been for, guys? Reckoning painting? Uh, sewing? If you know, I'll let us know in the comments. This is the next room. Wow, look at the wallpaper. Green and black stripes, They're sort of like goldish yellow textured wallpaper. 
it's quite yeah. a very common sort of pattern that you'd see on uh, normal wallpapers of uh, today's as well. Well, a little similar. Wow. So many amazing fireplaces in here. Look at that. Against that green wallpaper as well. There. Wow. Again, I always love this sort of wooden panelling in these buildings. Wow, look at that. That's, that's an old uh, radio, isn't it? Yeah, it's an old radio. Amazing. Again, we have that sign going, coming about. Leave. It's warning us. But we have so much to show you guys. Wow. Wow. It's very lovely wallpaper that. So I'm guessing this could have been a main door. It's actually as well. There's an, and this purple door here. A bit of a sink there, so I'm guessing this would have been a toilet. Look at the door and door as well. Outside there, this mansion, just to the back. We've got these uh, two outer sheds, mm, like a barn. Let's uh, check out in here first. It's not much, really. Besides a bit of car parts, tools, headlight there, and this uh, drawer here, to the side. Got a bit of a workbench here with all bits and bats basically. Barn here, to the side. Wow. Quite the sight, eh? <laughs> Two chairs here, crossed, just dangling. It's a bit random. Long mower. Okay, we've got another sort of bit of a shelf and a workbench here. Cooker, so not be forget ink cooker, eh? Start to brew the brews while you're working hard away. Out of shed here, as you can see. It's got one of those swings as well on the end. And then further back here, obviously, we'll show you from certain far because it is in bad disrepair anyway. And there's a lot of thorns to go through. But there's a bit of a greenhouse back there too. So yeah, behind the barn. Back here, look at this chair. Wow. So stand it up. Two. It's amazing guys. Look at features. 
clearly missing one arm but still looks amazing wow another sort of workshop greenhouse as well called this see why so we've got the uh, benches again in here See that's one thing that worried me in here last time. It looks very barn like, doesn't it? Given off how it looks with all this wood. Wonder what that would be. Almost looks like a bit of part of a clamp stand. And obviously you've got your lawnmower. But yeah, I was saying this looks like a bit of a greenhouse, giving off the uh, glass here. And obviously you might have had a few plants going across these 